I would like to talk about eye symmetry today. Very few people have symmetrical faces, but it's often not noticeable unless it's extreme. As we get older though, our eyes start to droop and the weaker eye will droop more than the stronger eye and it will become more noticeable. So I'd like to show you a little exercise that will strengthen your weak eye and you're gonna feel it right away. So let's get started. Now, let's sit up straight, shoulders back and down, chest open, heart open, face relaxed. Uh, I'm gonna start on the right side because my right side is my droopier eye. I know it looks like the left, but it's the right. We're gonna make a C with our hands and we're gonna place our index finger firmly right there on that bone, right below or sometimes on your eyebrow, depending upon your face. But it's gonna be just above the ridge and we're gonna push down and out with it. And then we're just gonna place our thumb gently here beside our nostril. While we're pushing down, we are going to open our eyes as wide as possible and I will count it for 10. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Come out of the pose. Close your eyes, take a breath. Now you feel that, don't you? I'm gonna do the left side as well because there are some people who have a left eye droopier than the right eye. So let's make the C. Place your index finger there, just above the ridge. Park your thumb lightly. And we're gonna push down and out with that index finger. Don't do anything with your thumb and open our eyes as wide as possible. And I'll count for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Come out of the pose. Breathe in, breathe out. You can blink during this exercise. Your eyeballs will get dry if you don't blink. Let's do the right side again. Put your index finger right there above the ridge. Park your thumb. Press down and out and open your eyes as wide as possible. And I'll count for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come out of the pose, close your eyes, breathe in, breathe out. Let's go right over to the left side now. Make your C, put that index finger there on the ridge, park your thumb gently, push down and out with that pointer, Open your eyes as wide as possible, and I will count for 10. One, two, keep breathing, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Come out of the pose, close your eyes. Take a breath, let it out. Let's do this all. One more time. Now, why don't I do the right and who's ever got the droopier left, you do the left. It doesn't do much good if we keep doing both eyes. So make your C, place it right there above your ridge. Gently put your thumb there by your nostril. Let's push down and out. Open our eyes as wide as possible and I'll count for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come out of the pose. Close your eyes. Breathe in. Breathe out. Open your eyes and relax. 
Let's end today's practice with a little forehead tapping to relieve all the stress we've put on this frontalis muscle. So we're gonna start at our eyebrows and tap up and down as we work our way out to the temples and then back to the center. And then we're gonna start the piano tapping out the same way and back in. We're going to relax this muscle and bring some blood, fresh oxygenated blood to the area, and then we'll be finished. So let's do it. Tapping. Now piano. We're finished.